Hoopers, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're doing well. I hope that you're happy quarantining. I hope that you're not too bored. I hope this video cheers you up because a lot goes wrong in it, let me tell you. Oh my god, my nipples. <laughs> um, today I just thought I'd film a really easy, natural, glam, glowy look. Um, I don't, yeah. I don't mind how it turned out, found it pretty good. Um, it's just my everyday makeup, I could do it in another 10 minutes. If the outfit looks familiar, that's because it is. If you don't know where this outfit is, it's actually in a video that I filmed yesterday. And you should go and watch it now. Because the outfits I made were pretty good, got a lot of compliments. Thank you for the compliments, I'm really glad you all enjoyed it. Um, but yeah, enough rambling. I just thought I'd show with you an easy natural glam makeup look that you can do in under 10 minutes during your quarantine to look good for yourself and on FaceTime to your boyfriend because that's all I can do right now. So if you'd like to keep on watching please do, if you'd like to leave a like, comment, all that jazz it means the world. Thank you so much, thank you so much to everyone that's subscribing. I've noticed I've got 167 subscribers. Kinda crazy. I have a really good idea for how thousand subscribers can I just say. I think it's going to be really good if I do that as fingers crossed. Uh, enough rambling, let's get into the video. See ya! Okay, got my coffee this time because it's the morning. Okay, let's begin. Um, so my makeup is the easiest thing you're ever going to do because it takes me about 5 minutes, 10 minutes if I really rush and it fits all in one bag so yeah I'm really kind of like just I want my makeup done and dusted and that's it I'm going to start off with foundation and I know that's quite weird I've already moisturised my face by the way I use the Origins mask if you've seen that in the video a couple of videos before I talk about skincare there so have a wee watch that um, but I'm going to be using the Dream Urban Cover Full Coverage. This is the best foundation ever. So I'm going to be using Peaches and Cream Brushes. It's a present that one of my friends got me. Best present ever because I use them all the time. So I just evenly coat the brush and we start to cake our face. I actually don't need um, pow powder with this which is actually really interesting because I used to use powder all the time and now I don't. Oh, I also meant to say I'm using the shade <clears throat> Warm Nude, 128 Warm Nude. I really love the colour of this foundation. I think it's a really nice match for my skin when I'm tanned. It just blends quite nicely and it leaves quite a nice finish which I like. And the fact you don't need powder as well is brilliant because I can never be bothered using powder in the morning. The Revolution Super Size Conceal and Define in the shade C2. And we're just going to lightly go there, above the brow, a bit there, a bit there, a bit there, a bit there. Everywhere, to be honest, lots of things to conceal on my face. So, how has everyone's quarantine been? I'm doing my makeup for no reason because I'm really trying to start like getting a routine because I feel like even when I was in uni, I didn't even have a routine, <clears throat> and now I'm really trying to get back into something. So, I've been waking up every day um, at eight o'clock. Was it is in 10 o'clock right now um, so yeah I'm really trying to like have my old a, a sort of routine so I don't sit and sleep and do nothing I'm actually gonna make a, a like a productivity video about this whole quarantine thing if you would like to see that well I'm gonna film it anyway um, so I think I'm gonna do that about like having like some sort of routine and like getting productive and actually doing things because honestly I never thought I'd say it I'm sick of my phone like I can't be talking about it anymore um, I just miss like we were, me and my family were talking about this like the importance of like social interaction like I feel crazy because we're just 
not seen anyone or done anything. And we went, me and my sister went to Alistair. And I didn't even want to look at anyone. I was really scared. <laughs> I was like, I don't. I'm a bit paranoid. As you can see, really nice, even base. Nice colour. Really, really love this foundation. If there's if one thing that you should get from this video, it's the foundation. It's super good, wearable, and I don't need powder, and it's really nice the full day. So, definitely get involved in that. Troops. So, the next steps are a little bit strange. Um, I like to do my lipstick so that by the time it dries, it's a really nice colour. Um, this is my. Well, this stuff is my food. This is the Kiko Milano. I'm I don't know. To double touch. I'll link it down below but it's great. I use this as my lip liner to line my lips and then I'll let it dry. So that's not the colour that we want just now. It will change. It will be a better colour, don't worry. I normally just part it. This looks really daft. Look there with me. Oh no, this doesn't look good. I look like that character out of Monty Sink. Oh my <laughs> god. I'm gonna do it. Um, so next we're gonna do um, bronzer, which is my go to. Like, see if I was stranded in a desert island, bronzer. Only thing I use. I love it. I could honestly just wear it. This looks really daft. Please ignore this. This does not look good. Um, so we're going to use the Give Me Sun bronzer. This is great. Um, I really love them. Look at that. Everyone tells me that my bronzer is too dark and orange. And I don't care because I like orange. Orange is good. Can I just say as well? Actually not even right. Like I spend that is the thing about productivity, like I can't bloody do it because I'm sitting watching tick I could sit and watch TikTok for four hours. I literally went on my phone, I was like, I was just going TikTok for a wee bit. Like didn't think anything of it. It was literally like two o'clock in the morning. I'd been on TikTok for four hours. Like what? See because there's no like time you can't see the time with TikTok. So it's like you're just scrolling and scrolling and scrolling and then you don't realise the time and I'm like oh. So make the wee collarbones pop. My top secret. Also as well, I thought I'd say this. Um, a lot of people would say that I have abs, right? And I would just like to show you. I don't. Do I know who has abs? Mac Give Me Sun has abs. Like, look, that's not me. See so if you ever see me and you think, wow, she looks like she has abs. I don't. My bronzer has abs. Just a wee top tip for nights out if you want to feel a bit more confident. Contour your abs. Who cares? Contour your boobs. Contour everything. That's what I'm good at. I'm a pro at contouring boobs because I don't have them. Um, another top tip I like to do is uh, sometimes if I don't have time to do eyeshadow, I'll use this brush and I'll just. Make some eyeshadow. I love to like wing, like a wing look of like using a bronzer and winging it in my crease, like bringing it way up there. It just gives a really like you see, super cute. Um, we're now to go on to. Oh my brows! <laughs> I literally never do my brows, so I literally brought this, bought this in a win. And I've used it ever since. I need to get a new one actually. It's the collection in Credit Brow. It's literally just, I just like to comb them. I've actually stopped plucking my eyebrows. So I've got quite bushy brows just now, but I quite like the bushy look. I think it's quite nice. I think it's just quite natural. I honestly, my eyebrows before get me straight. Oh my god, they were awful. Saying that, I could probably look back in about two years time and be like, oh my god, these are awful. But the 
they're kind of as natural as you can get so on nights out I'll sometimes shake them a bit and the camera died love that love that where were we I can't remember what I was talking about um, um <clears throat> Top throat, you make me para. Um, so brows are done really like simple, literally nothing. I'm going to actually go in with the bronzer and just add a little bit more definition in my crease. This is not how people should be doing makeup, I just don't care. I want to be in the makeup, I just I think it's quite hard and I don't think I have the right utensils for it like I don't think my brush I need to invest in some like good brushes you know I think that's my downfall because I'm good at like some things and then other things I'm like oh, so free. don't do that again um, so we're now going to use the cheapest mascara you can get at Superdrug fun fact that is that's why I bought it because it's the cheapest one um, I actually wouldn't recommend this I don't like it but I'm not wasting. I'm getting every bit of product that I can get. Oh. All the times I've done my makeup, I've never done that before. Oh. oh. Subscribe for more makeup content. <laughs> oh my god, no. Do you know what? I don't care. Pretend it's not there. I just sit and film in a makeup video and I mess up. Just pretend it's not there, it's fine. Oh my god, my nipples. <laughs> oh, this video's a mess. <laughs> Scatter, anyway. As you can see, I have no lashes, they don't exist. But we move forward, it is fine. So now we're going to move on to the final lip steps. So I like to take MAC and the shade Honey Love, dot it and the centre. Pat it in. I like to pat my lipsticks in. That works the best. And then finish with a gloss. Voila. It's really funny. Um, a lot of people ask me if I get my lips done. I don't. Um, yeah, I've actually had quite a few salons reach out to me and ask like, to give me treatments to like promote their company or brand or whatever. And I've actually just said no because I'm like, I can't really be bothered. Like, I just overlay my lips. <laughs> We're gonna be taking the highlighter. This is the Sub-Zero. I got this with the BH Cosmetics event and honestly, it's amazing. I'm going to be taking just a mixture of all the light shades. Gives such a nice glowy look. I love it. Love it on the nose. And how could we forget our collarbones? <laughs> love it. Love, love. I'm gonna refix my hair and then I will show you the finished complete look. Okay, I thought I would just put my hair up so you can see the full look. Super soft, easy. It will literally take me under 10 minutes to do this at home. I'm in a rush. Super cute. Okay, that is the final video. I hope it was somehow educational. I'm sorry for messing up so many times. The video was a bit of a flop to be honest, but my makeup is a fault, so it's fine. <laughs> um, if you liked the video, please give it a big thumbs up. If there was anything I could have improved on, let me know. Um, any suggestions for new videos, please let me know down below. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Uh, have a lovely day. And <clears throat> I will see you very, very soon. Love you. Bye.